Hello guys, I thought I'd do a quick update about what's happening with me so far. Um, basically, I'm just messing around. <laughs> um, I don't really have any big work going on until at least May, where I've got my first wedding of this year. Um, right now, I'm just in talks with a lot of friends who want, to, who want me to do a lot of their model work. And probably just going to be free for them as well. The reason I'm doing this is because model work is something I'm in a great area at the moment. I've only done maybe one major model shoot and I think it was one and a, one minor one but I haven't posted those photos up yet. Um, so I just want to just jump straight into it in the next couple of months with that because it's getting, so, it's getting pretty close to spring and summer. All this, it's going to be a brilliant time to get the start getting into model work so hopefully that'll be a good thing, that, good thing to do and add on to my portfolio. So hopefully you guys look forward to that on my fan page and my website. So hopefully I'll put two links there. Um, now, uh, one more thing. Uh, another thing is my birthday is coming up next month. And I'm trying to decide if I should get a lens baby or a tablet. Now, the lens baby, if you don't know what a lens baby is, it's like a selective focus lens you can stick on your camera where it's where the bow actually moves in and out and you can actually adjust the movement. Um, it's got a really good shallow depth of field and you can actually selectively choose where you want to focus on the image and I think that'd be brilliant for my model work and even my weddings so um, I don't think I don't I think I'll probably go for the lowest cost version which is the lens baby muse so I'm tempted to get that or a finally get myself a tablet the reason I want the tablet is because it'd be a great carry around as a portfolio because you would normally, normally as a portfolio, you would have a big, giant, heavy folder with like 20, 20, 30 odd images of all your work and you want to show that to the client. At least with a, at least with a tablet, you can actually store your images, as probably all my images, and then just show them to a new client and they'll just save your, save your space and save you some printing time and that. So I think that'd be a brilliant thing to carry around. Obviously, I think you should still have a hard copy of all your images in case they would prefer to see a hard copy. But I think a tablet would just be a little bit more convenient. So I'm, I'm tossing in between the two. Um, and one more thing is, I'm, uh, I might be doing another video soon, uh, probably a short video of me trying to build up my own DIY camera. You can get these DIY cameras which are which you build yourself and it only costs about maybe £10. I found a couple of eBay sellers in the UK who found it was selling for £10. Normally you would have to import them from Hong Kong or China, but I guess they're getting popular over here. Um, it's like a very, the DIY, the DIY camera is a very plastic camera, but it has a, it has a very similar look to the old Roller Flex camera if you had back in the 1950s, 1960s to the 1970s. So I'll probably be buying one of those kits and maybe doing a video of me building one or showing you the unboxing of it. So hopefully that'll be, that'll be a nice thing to show you. So um, that's it for now. Um, hopefully I'll be doing some, doing some more video logs in the future. I probably won't be doing a lot of these, but I will be doing one maybe once every so often. And I'll probably do some video logs during some of my model shoots and that, if my friends don't mind. So anyway guys, thank, thank you for watching and um, hope you like the fan page. And I hope you like the website. So. See you guys later. Bye-bye.